In this video, revealing how to make money on Robinhood and how complete beginners earning $100 to $700 a day with no experience. More at that after the intro. Hey guys, how's it going? Mike Vasile here. Welcome to this video. Before we actually begin, I remind you that several spots have opened up for this week's free workshop where it's the fastest and easiest way to make money online. Sign up for it in the link below. We literally have a 62 year old woman go from zero to 160 grand profit in as little as 90 days. So check it out right now. Did you know that there's multiple ways to make money with Robinhood that not a lot of people actually know about? And the craziest thing is you could do it with no money down with barely any of your time and with no experience whatsoever. And in this video, we are literally gonna cover all of them. So the first way is understanding investment principles to just begin with. So when I first got started in investing, I would literally go to sites like Robinhood and I'd be like, oh my God, commission-free investing. And I would get excited because you know the traditional ways of investing online, like you know, in any of the old brokerage firms is you would actually have to pay a fee whenever you would have to want to buy and sell stock. So of course, when I went into Robinhood and I was like, oh my God, this is crazy. This is commission-free trading. My gambling mind started going a little bit crazy and I wanted to find, you know, the, the new Tesla or the new GameStop that could actually make me get rich quick overnight. Little did I know that this was actually very, very bad investment principles and because that whenever I followed those trends of investing just because this is what like some social media guru says oh I need to invest in this I ended up losing more money than not and even though this is not financial advice I wish somebody gave this to me when I first got started and that was just learning exactly how Warren Buffett actually goes ahead and invests. what no one realizes is Robin Hood attracts kind of like the gambler mentality mindset of an investor which is the worst thing that you could possibly do when you're getting started in investing. But one of the things that I have time and time again have helped me out no matter how much FOMO and fear of missing out that I had, whenever I would see somebody getting rich off of like a Tesla stock or a GameStop stock, is uh, Warren Buffett's advice of be fearful when others are greedy and greedy when others are fearful. Now here's the thing, okay? When, when everyone's talking about the latest stock, the odds are the opportunity is long gone. Like I remember back in like 2017, I was in Thailand, right? And I was in a cab. And while the cab driver was like talking to me, he was like, hey, did you invest in Bitcoin? And the moment I'm starting to see like the cab driver or normal people like my grandma and grandpa start talking about like a certain investment, odds are it's probably a time when everybody else is greedy and that's when I should be the most fearful and sell off my stock, right? That one concept alone, I did not know that in the past when I would do certain investings like with companies like Robinhood and I would end up losing a bunch of money when I did not follow this trade. The next one is if you aren't willing to own a stock for 10 years, don't even think about owning it for 10 minutes because my mentality before was, oh my God, I could get rich quick. I'm gonna go hold this for like five minutes and then I'm gonna sell it and I'm gonna make a bunch of money. But in the, the hard thing about making money with stocks, especially with like Robinhood, is not necessarily when you go ahead and buy it. It's when you have the educational you know, information of when you could actually go ahead and sell it. If you do not have a horizon of when you actually know you're gonna sell it, it's gonna be hard to make money and easier to lose money because you're always gonna be reactive in the marketplace. That's why what Warren Buffett says is he only buys and invests in companies that he actually believes in. The second way, which is a lot more less risky approach that doesn't require any money whatsoever, is actually just creating content about it. So what a lot of people are doing is they're coming up to here and they're, for example, creating content that all of these things that pop up Literally, people are searching for things on platforms like Google, Pinterest, YouTube, and whatnot. But the craziest thing is when you understand that there's a demand of people you know, learning about certain things, what happens is people start talking about it and accidentally end up making money. Like you can see, if you make content about any of these things, if you don't have any money whatsoever, you don't even have a camera whatsoever, you literally just need you know, a laptop and like maybe your iPhone as a camera. If you start creating content about this on what you're learning based off of Robinhood, you could actually get paid really good money. Like I'm talking about, because this is in the financial industry, you could see when I started realizing this, we literally went from like $7 a day in August 15 to within six months made $300 a day with no money down and I didn't have to you know, understand and read all these financial charts of when to buy and sell different companies and whatnot that I would invest in with like apps like Robinhood. Now I know this isn't financial advice, but like I said, this is what I wish I knew earlier on because around this time when all the FOMO was happening in the world, right, I was just literally 
like, uh, how do you say reactive in losing a bunch of money because I was constantly trying to time it and you know, just trying to get rich quick off of certain stocks. But then I started realizing what are media outlets doing? They're literally creating content because with that demand comes, you know, uh, the ability to sell advertising space, which is how, you know, this channel makes money. And you can see it started growing to $300 a day. Now that money, I started understanding, okay, I can literally take this money that didn't take any of my own money to go ahead and get started. And now I can invest it into certain companies through Robinhood that I actually want to own for the next 10, 20, 30 years and make money the Warren Buffett way instead of, you know, the traditional get rich quick way. And not only that, the crazy thing is it just started growing even more. Like if you look at the past 28 days now, we're averaging anywhere from like a thousand thousand dollars a day to thirteen hundred dollars a day and if you would have told me back when I was in college starting to become a dentist that this was actually possible I would have thought you were insane because I didn't think that people could actually make money sharing to people the thing that it is that they're learning the next way to make money with Robin Hood is by recommending it to friends but not necessarily friends um, that like go to your school or your, your co-employees and whatnot I'm talking about just like creating videos about it and recommending Robin Hood itself as a platform because when you actually go and refer people to Robin Hood you can earn up to five $500 in reward calendar stock. Now that's the thing, you know, a lot of influencers are literally getting, you know, a Robin Hood affiliate link, which is what it is, which essentially you get paid not to create like a platform like Robin Hood, but every time you refer somebody to Robin Hood, you could actually go ahead and make money with it based off of when people trade on Robin Hood. And you can see a lot of people go ahead and do this. You know, a lot of people make Robin Hood tutorials and then they talk about, you know, sign up for Robin Hood in the link in the description. We do something similar to that with affiliate marketing. The only downside is with Robinhood, you are only limited to $500 in stock for the entire calendar year, which is why we ended up pivoting and started recommending more products that you there doesn't have a cap or a limit. And you can see why in the past 30 days doing this, you know, we netted about $56,000 net, which some of these days you can see this low day was $1,100. This day was $500. So you could only imagine what these like bigger days are when you see the past 30 days and you can see in the past seven days, we've netted about like $10,000 in that guys. But those are all the ways to make money with Robin Hood that not a lot of people are talking about. Most people literally take like the get rich quick mentality and they're like, oh, I'm gonna go find the next Tesla. Or I'm gonna go find the next GameStop. But they fail to realize that the safer way to make money are literally all the ways that I talked about. Now remember, this isn't financial advice. I'm not a financial advisor. This is all the things that I wish I knew when I was first getting started. And if you want a faster and easier way to make money online, sign up for this week's free workshop where we have a 62 year old woman go from zero to $160,000 profit in 90 days. Sign up for it in the link below. As well as check out my podcast for all these multimillionaires that literally live here in Bali, like this 11 year old girl that turned on $30 million and this guy that makes a million dollars per month profit. Hopefully, yourselves. I love you guys. See you guys later. You.